Thank you, Madam Deputy Speaker. What a curious idea that we're obliged to conduct foreign policy collectively, that we have no influence in the world as independent voices. Consider the example of non-EU Norway, a nation of five million people whose diplomats have nonetheless been active on almost every continent and archipelago. They negotiated the peace deal between Sudan and South Sudan, uh, the Oslo Accords between Israel and the Palestinians. They are active in Southeast Asia, in Sri Lanka. Don't you think that a large country might just be able to have an impact on world affairs. The United Kingdom is a nation of 63 million, a trading maritime nation connected by its enterprise, by habit and history, by law and language to every continent. I think we might just be able, as the fifth largest economy and the fourth military power in the world, to have some kind of independent foreign policy and to state the obvious, you are more influential in foreign policy Thank you, than sir. you have we your now, foreign policy. For one minute I give the floor to Madam Gill.